Sandro Ruet. والآن مع كلمة الفائز بجائزة عيسى لخدمة الإنسانية الدكتور ساندوك رويت Your Highness, Your Excellencies I believe uh, there are a lot of distinguished ambassadors from many parts of the world The members of the jury of ISA Award Foundation And ladies and gentlemen Assalamu alaikum. Respectful namaste to you all. I bring you very warm greetings and lots of love from the people of Nepal, the mountainous and lovely country of Nepal, who have been moved by the generosity of your majesty and the Kingdom of Bahrain for this prestigious award we have been moved and touched by the hospitality given to us in the last few days I am convinced that the ISA award renowned for service to humanity represents the true value of this great country and its people truly after the great late majesty I think frankly speaking the impartiality the inclusiveness and serious attempt to find game-changing humanitarian work at the far and flung grassroots levels. Not many awards would do this. So I really think this award is very, very special. My lifelong passion for service to humanity through caring, curing needless blindness regardless of accessibility and affordability of the patients, thereby helping significantly reducing poverty. I now feel that I have been able to touch the lives and the heart and the soul of millions of people globally. Your Majesty, your Highness, Your Excellencies, I and my family accept this award, prestigious award, on behalf of millions of, I said millions of patients that I have been part of in the last about 35 to 40 years, Your Majesty. Yeah. And uh, my team and the entire Nepalese people whose goodwill and best wishes I bring to this distinguished gathering. The award will further increase the credibility of Tilganga Institute of Ophthalmology, TKRF, HCP, the Fred Hollows Foundation, some of the organizations that I've been working closely in combating global blindness. Mr. Tez and I have vowed to touch half a million people across the globe in the next five years. In the next five years, especially to those who cannot access and afford the surgery, could be in Africa, could be in Asia, could be in South America, but we have, uh, I think this award really gives us strong credibility to move further into these areas. I'm sure that the award will further 
inspire. I'm sure that the award will further inspire humanitarian work being done in different parts of the world, irrespective of their political, social, geographical, and economic connectivity. And uh, I can promise that I will become a great ambassador for the ESA Award, Your Majesty. Thank you very much.